hi guys and welcome back once again we are back with another unboxing um and this one is for a rookie group that i definitely fell head over heels for um i didn't like their pre-debut so much but their debut album was definitely amazing and this one was not a disappointment either We'll be unboxing MCND's first mini album, Earth Age, in the Earth and Kepler versions. I believe this will be the last of the unboxings for a while. I do have a stack of albums that I need to unbox, but they're like catch up hauls versus like new releases. I think the next one that I have is Stray Kids. Um, and then I'm planning on getting Super M's albums, Black Pink, since those are up for pre order um and then uh, whenever treasure comes up so i don't think i've there's too many comebacks soon the only thing is that there's a few comebacks but there's a lot of versions like for blackpink there's four versions this time and then super m there's like seven versions oh uh, my goodness i'm stressed um anyways i got both the earth age uh versions for mcnd and then i also got some bts albums i got too cool for school and school love affair you guys know i'm trying to work on my bts collection um with my bts collection i don't feel so pressured to collect them so i'm just collecting them at my own pace slowly whenever i feel like it i do love bts a lot and they're definitely one of my old groups but i don't feel pressured to buy their albums and support them as much just because there's already so much love and support for them um, and so I try to spend my money on more smaller underrated or underhyped or like just smaller groups um, it's like definitely one of my passions about k-pop I love supporting the small little rookie groups and the underrated groups so so much okay and we're gonna go ahead and start with the earth version Oh my goodness, what a step up from their debut album. Their debut album was definitely really, really gorgeous and clean for a debut album. It's definitely one of the better debut albums that I've seen, but what a step up album. It's like box style. It's absolutely gorgeous and stunning. The colors, the text, like everything's beautiful. It's definitely such a step up and I'm so proud of them. Um, MCMD is definitely killing it and I hope to continue to see them grow and even like gain more popularity which is so crazy they're amazing rookies oh my goodness i'm struggling <laughs> give me one second okay there we go i absolutely love the colors like the dark black and blue it just mixes so well i love the galaxy vibe i don't really have an album with this colors yet i don't think So the photo book pretty much just matches uh, the uh, album packaging. And so let's get into the photo book. Oh my goodness, there they are. I love their outfits. I love the gold and black. Gorgeous. Oh my goodness, what a gorgeous group photo. They Their gazes literally look so good there. I love their vibe so, so much. And honestly, they're so funny. Um, I'm definitely not caught up on MCND content as much as I'd like to be. Um, I'm actually so, so behind on so many groups, even NCT guys. Like I clicked on a video the other day and it told me it was from five months ago. And I was like, dang, I'm so behind. I honestly can't keep up with all the content with how many groups I'm collecting, but I try my best. I literally love these photos so, so much. Look at how gorgeous. I love the red background. And their play with the shadows and light. I love it. They're such fashionistas. I love their stylists. Yes, fashionistas. I'm telling you, they look so good. Honestly, they could probably wear a trash bag and I they'd probably still look good. There we have a Castle J with the strong gaze and charisma. I love his vibe so much. <gasps> then we got Big. I love his outfit. I love grays and like pastel greens together. It's my kind of color. Oh my goodness. Literally look at how good Min Jae looks. So freaking good. Unbelievable. <gasps> and then we got Hui Jun. I love his photos. He literally looks like he's just chilling and these are like candid photos and then we got win his hair suits him i've been into idols with red hair lately they just look so good but minjay's teal hair is absolutely gorgeous on him too i love 
Oh, the green stairs. And then we have the tracklist. Honestly, if you guys haven't heard this album, you totally should. My favorite is Beautiful and Bumping. It's really interesting because the album goes from like, um, it goes like a hype and then it kind of chills down and then it goes back to hype all of a sudden. And honestly, y'all need to give it a listen. It's so, so good. All right. And moving on to the CD, you get a little sleeve like this. And this is what the CD looks like. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the colors so, so much. Next up, we have the sticker sheet. I love the sticker sheet. It's so bright and colorful. If I had extra albums, I would totally use the stickers. And then next up, we have the bookmark. Next up, we have the bookmark and the ID card. So this is what the bookmark looks like. And then for my ID card, I pulled Weijun. Look how cute he is. Oh, such a cutie. The red outfit definitely is very bright. I'm going to go ahead and put the string back before I lose it because I am terribly disorganized. Okay, and then for my photo card, Castle J. Hello. Oh my goodness. I love his shirt there. I haven't decided if I want to collect MCND photo cards yet. I still have my pool from their first album, and I'm probably going to hold on to the pools from these albums too. I can't decide if I want to collect them or not. I feel like I'm very neutral. Like, I don't really care if I collect them, but it'd be nice to collect them. Um, but I just have so many other groups that I'm collecting right now that I'm not even close to being done. So it's very highly likely possible that I may trade away my MCND pulls, but uh, it kind of hurts my soul. You would think you kind of get used to letting go of photo cards eventually, but I still struggle with it to this day. Um, I have attachment issues. All right, now we're on to the Kepler version. I definitely love the design of this one too. It's definitely very vibrant, definitely stands out. I've been very into um, bright colored albums. I feel like I've mentioned this like every single video lately, but I have been so into bright colored albums. I feel like it definitely gives my room a brighter vibe. Um, and I just feel happier looking at brighter colors lately for some reason. Um, my room used to be literally always dark and like black and it was just not a happy place to be in but now it's definitely so much more brighter, white, colorful, and I definitely love it. Oh my goodness, look at that smile from Vic. Is that, I, oh my goodness, I feel like that's the first time I've seen him smile. Like, I feel like he barely smiles um, in the, the photo book shoots, at least. Oh my goodness, look at Weijun killing it. He looks like such a soft boy and cute and innocent. I love them so much. Coca-Cola! Are y'all sponsored yet? I swear idols love Coca-Cola and when I think of Coca-Cola, I think of Treasure too because Haruto loves um, Coca-Cola. I love... Why did they... <laughs> Big face there definitely looks so funny. He looked so agitated. It's like, why am I here? Oh, so cute. I love. Oh my goodness. I want more smiley and like bright photos of them. Oh my goodness. Huijun is killing it. He's so stunning. We got Win. I love his hair color. Everyone literally looks like a freaking king. And then we have the track list and lyrics. All right, there we go. That's the end of that photo book. And moving on to the CD, it's pretty much the same, just in the red design. 
I want to see them do a soft um, concept where they're just like cute and innocent and like smiley. Like I would die for that type of concept next. I'm not joking. All right, and then we have the bookmark and ID card and I pulled Minjay this time. Look at how adorable he is. And oh, I cut Castle J again. Look how cute he is. I'm so glad I pulled um, both of his cards. I believe in total there's five for each. So one for each member and then one group photo for each uh, version. So there's six photo cards for each version. But debatably i still don't know if i'll be collecting them but yeah this is pretty much the end of this unboxing i'll see you guys in my next video bye